All right, let's take some flame test data. So we have our setup that we'll use for all of these stations, which is a pile of wooden sticks, a beaker of water, the chemical, the flame, and then the beaker for waste. So for all of them, we will do this procedure. So we take our stick, dip it in the water so that it gets wet, and then put it in the chemical, and then we can place it in the flame. Oops, get some more there. Place it in the flame to see the color. All right, so we describe that as sort of like a pinkish red, I would say. And then we put it out in the waste beaker. That chemical was lithium. Lithium was our first one. All right, our next chemical that we're going to do is copper. So copper is our next one, Cu. We're going to do that same procedure where we dip the stick, we get the chemical on the stick, and put it in the flame. All right, so this one definitely we would say like bright green. We're going to put that in the water. All right, our next chemical is SR, strontium. Strontium, you can see what it looks like there. Let's get our stick wet, get the chemical on the stick, and place in the flame. So this one is maybe more a little bit like pure red instead of pink red for this one maybe. That last one that we saw, that lithium was had more of like a pinkish tint to it. This one was more like just like a pure red. All right, our next chemical is barium. You can see what it looks like there, BA for barium. So get the stick wet, put a chemical on it, and this one color-wise, ooh, I would say for sure yellow, like a bright lemon yellow. That orange on the fringe is not as much. I would say mostly just yellow. All right, coming around here. Um, this one is our unknown, so this is going to match one of the other ones eventually, but let's just record the data for now. So stick wet, get that chemical on there. Okay, try to go this way so we can see it a little bit better. Okay, and so this one again, definitely that like, kind of that like bright pink red. All right. Our next one that we are testing is Na sodium, Na. Get our Stick wet, get the chemical on there, in the flame. Ooh, <laughs> for sure bright orange, nothing else, just a flame orange there. Making sure not to get the stick to burn, because then all we're going to see is the orange from the stick burning. Um, this next chemical is K, so this is potassium. All right, get that wet, get that on there. Okay, now this one's a little bit tricky to see, so I'm going to try to stand this way. So we're looking for... Yeah, this one's a little bit hard to see in the video, but if you look towards, like, right at the tip of the stick, you'll see sort of, like, other than, like, just bright yellow and orange, there's also some, like, lavender. So that's what we're going to say for this one. So it's a little bit hard to see in the video, but definitely lavender for potassium. And our last one is calcium, C-A. Oh, I've got to grab another stick. All right. So C-A. So we'll get our stick wet here. Get some of the chemical on it. And this one for color, let me get this direction. So this one we're going to see kind of like red-orange, I would say. So it's got some orange tint to it, but definitely some red as well. And there is your data for the Flame Test Lab.